Now, just yesterday, we had covered a video on Bento ML. This is a framework for creating, shipping, and scaling different ranges of AI applications. Now, I also mentioned how Bento ML was able to create a very useful tool called Open LLM. It's something that can facilitate the operations of large language models in production. Now, I also stated that I would need to create a full on video for this. And this is where I actually create this video showcasing Open LLM. It's an open platform for operating different types of large language models. It's something that will help facilitate the operation of it, as well as helping you fine tune, serve and deploy, as well as monitor any large language model with ease. It's open sourced and it's something that can facilitate the development of different types of large language models in real world applications. Now with open LLM, you can run inference on any open source large language model, deploy them on the cloud or even on premise and it helps you build different types of powerful AI applications. We got some great news coming out of the Patreon page as we have a couple more subscriptions being given out this month. Now, this month we had a total of four different subscriptions being given out to our Patreons and this just shows how unique and how amazing this community is. We've been focusing really, really hard on providing you guys with the best content as well as the best applications for free for just simply joining our Patreon page. You not only access subscriptions, but you access resources, collaboration, networking opportunities, and so much more. Definitely take a look at the Patreon link in the description below if you want to access our private Discord. Now, just take a look at this video demo, which is showcasing how a personal conversational chatbot is created super easily based off your own data. Now, this is done within a couple of seconds using open large language model. You simply select the model. Now, in this case, they're selecting a Facebook AI model and they're infusing it with their own context. We later see in the video that you're able to ask it certain things and this will basically answer your queries based off of what the context you actually provided it. Now, this is what we're going to be showcasing throughout today's video as we're going to be showcasing how you can deploy, fine tune and monitor any large language model within open LLM. This is a great tool that will help facilitate the operation of your large language model. Now, it's crazy to think that this is an application or a tool, you can say, that was created using Bento ML. This is something that we showcased in my previous video. So if you're interested in this, definitely take a look at this as this is a platform you can see right over here that it's for software engineers to build AI products. It's something that is going to be very revolutionary in my opinion. So definitely take a look at this as it's completely free and it will definitely help you guys out. But with that thought guys, let's get straight into the video as we uncover what you can do with open LLM. So let's get straight into it. If you would like to book a one-on-one -on -one with me where you can access my consulting services, where I can help you grow your business or basically give you a lot of different types of solutions with AI, definitely take a look at the calendar link in the description below. Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to another YouTube video at the world of AI. In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at open large language model. This is an open platform that's tailored for operating large language models seamlessly in production. It provides a user-friendly environment for AI application developers, and it's something that offers an extensive array of tools and features. Now, with open large language model, you can basically effortlessly fine tune, serve, deploy, as well as monitor any large language model model that you want. It's streamlining the entire deployment process, which is really unique and it's something that will be very efficient for you. It's a platform that is specifically crafted to empower any sort of user or developer in building different types of robust production ready applications that can leverage the capabilities of large language models. This is something that I'll be showcasing as we go further down into the video. So how can you get started? Well, you can definitely get started with Google Colab and you can just use the Jupyter Notes, which you can take a look at over here. This is something that we'll mention as we go further into the video, but you can also start this up with Docker. This is a demonstration that they have uploaded on their GitHub repo. So if you're interested in this, you should definitely take a look at this. You can also start this up locally where you just need to install it with your command prompt, set up the virtual environment, have Python installed, and you can simply start working with it right away on your own local desktop. You're also able to start the server up. So if you're interested in this, I'll leave this repo link in the description below. And they also have a supported model list, which shows which model can be 
used to help facilitate the development of any sort of large language model that you're working on. Now, with that thought, guys, let's get to the next step where we showcase the Google Colab, where you can serve this on this. Now, let's actually emphasize on some of the key features that are associated with open large language model. Firstly, we want to talk about the integration of open source large language models. You are able to integrate any sort of open source large language model as well as any model runtime. This is not limited to Llama 2, Stable LM, or any of the ones that are listed over here. You have flexible APIs where you can serve large language models effortlessly with different types of RESTful APIs or GRPC. Now, this is like you can do this with a single command and that's something that can be integrated within your own client. You have the freedom to build further where you can basically have various different frameworks like Langchain, Bentel ML, Llama Index, OpenAI endpoints, as well as Hugging Face associated with whatever you're trying to operate with. This is going to be giving you the ability to create customized AI applications by seamlessly combining large language models with other models and services. You can streamline the deployment with Bento Cloud, which is something that's going to be coming out fairly shortly. So if you're interested in that, definitely take a look at my previous video, as well as join the Patreon, uh, as we're going to be giving out access for this very, very soon. Now, you're also able to bring your own large language model into fruition where you can fine tune any large language model according to your specific needs by providing it different types of context and ingesting it with that context. This is where open large language model actually supports loading LoRa layers for fine tuning models and it's going to enhance the accuracy as well as the performance for different types of tasks that your large language model will be operating for. It's a unified fine tuning API which allows models for different types of approaches. You also have quantization where you can run inference with reduced computational and memory costs. You also have the ability to stream and this is where open large language model supports token streaming to different types of server sent events. And lastly, you have continuous batching. This is the benefit from continuous batching via version large language model. This is to basically achieve increased total uh, throughput for your applications. And you can see that there's many different things that are provided with Open Large Language Model. And this is a product that has been continuously worked on over the months. They continue, continuously provide more updates and more integration to upgrade this overall framework so that you can basically use it to create any sort of large language model by fine tuning it, deploying it, and serving it. Now, just note that this is a Google Colab that is serving Llama 2 as an example. So just keep that in mind. Well, first things first, what you want to do is click on file and save this into your own drive. Once that is done, you want to go into the runtime and change your runtime to the best hardware that is available. Once that is done, you simply just click save and then you can move forward by setting up your environment. This is fairly easy. You can then start this up by running this code over here and then you can go further down. Now you just simply click on the blocks and download whatever blocks are needed. And we can see over here that you're also able to check different types of GPU and memory resources that are available from the Google Colab to have associated with this Jupyter Notebook. Now, if you go down, you can integrate different APIs. This is where we're seeing the Python API demo being integrated through Google Colab. You can test different types of prompts. So we can see over here, it's testing what is the weather like in San Francisco. You can clean it up. You can serve it in a demo server. You're also able to launch it within the server. And they basically go on a step-by-step -step process, which showcases how you can do so. So definitely recommend you read through each segment of the Google Colab notebook because it showcases how you can get started with this because this is a tool that will help you launch as well as deploy different types of models based off of Google Colab, which is super easy to use. Now, I know it might be a little complicated, but it's super easy. You just simply click on the blocks, specify the requirements, integrate the APIs, select the model, and you can get it running fairly easily. Now, that's basically it for how, like, as to how you can actually access this. And that's basically it for today's video, actually. I don't have anything else to state for this as we basically covered mostly everything. But 
if you do want me to go and deploy my own model, fine tune it with open large language model, I can definitely make a demo video on that as well. But with that thought, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I really, really appreciate it. Make sure you check out all the links in the description below so that you can access this fairly easily. Make sure you check out the Patreon page if you want to access different types of subscriptions, get networking opportunities, collaborations, and so much more. Make sure you follow us on Twitter if you guys haven't already. And lastly, make sure you guys subscribe, turn on the notification bell, like this video, and check out our previous videos so you can stay up to date with the latest AI news. But with that thought, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Have an amazing day. Spread positivity, and I'll see you guys fairly shortly. Peace out, fellas.